Hey, Tony. Hey, Troy. Hey, I was wondering if you have time to answer some questions about the M Farm side course. Yeah, of course. Do you mind if I mic you up? No problem. Awesome. I'm going to grab a coffee. Want to join me? Yeah, of course. Let's go. Cheers. So, as a prospective student of the M Farm side course, um, how does the course support students like me to learn? Well, that's a really good question, Troy. I think the main thing is we try and create a really positive learning environment for you. Uh, we don't have any lectures, so we spend a lot less time telling you exactly what you need to know, but mm. trying to guide you, show you the way to learn. I like to think of us, the teachers, as the guides for the students. Cool. Let's grab that coffee. There you go, Troy. Here's your latte. Thank you so much, Tony. Speaking of learning, could you briefly touch on the superstar team that you've assembled to teach the course? Yeah, superstar team, you said it. We've got staff uh, from, with both academic experience and real world industry experience, and they cover the whole range of pharmaceutical science, from the basic science uh, of, of identifying a target, of uh, trying to find molecules that interact with that target and how to formulate them, through to the design and implementation of clinical trials and how to use drugs effectively wow. in patients. Yeah, super interesting, cool. What do you think are some of the unexpected but interesting things we can learn in the course? Yeah, well as I said, we do cover the whole gamut of pharmaceutical science, but the uh, skills that the faculty has in mRNA vaccine development means that M farm size students get the opportunity hands-on to design, develop and manufacture an cool. mRNA vaccine. Uh, so that's very exciting. We have a focus on sustainability as well too, and how that really needs to sit at the center of all of the uh, uh, decisions that you uh, make in pharmaceutical science. Cool. So as students, we're eager to make our mark in the pharmaceutical industry. How does the course prepare us for that? Yeah, it's really about the skills, I guess, the teamwork, problem solving, oral and written communication skills that form the basis of your success uh, in, in, in your career, whether it's in research or in industry. Right. So how does the program support us in finding either a research placement or an industry placement? Yeah, so we spend some time actively with you in the third semester of the degree, building up a portfolio, helping you build up a portfolio of your knowledge and your skills, and then how to use that portfolio to help you find a placement. Now, we actively help you find that placement, whether it's in research or in industry as cool. well. Cool. Awesome. What is the most um, unique student placement that you've organised? Yeah, look, we take a pretty broad view of, of where we can place our students, but my favourite is the placement we found for a student in an accounting firm. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's not the place you'd expect a sure. pharmaceutical science graduate to end up, but this particular firm does the accounts for small to medium biotech industries, and the student that we have placed there is just perfectly suited to that. Uh, in fact, is working now full-time for that company after completing their placement. Oh, wow, amazing. What are some notable success stories that you have from the program so far? Yeah, well, I think the main success now is that we've graduated our first cohort of students through uh, the degree. Nearly all of the students that began the degree with us have completed. It's an almost 100% uh, completion rate, which is really something. Amazing. And many of the students now are taking the next step in their pharmaceutical science career, either in research, doing PhDs here in the, uh, at, uh, at MIPS, or um, in, in, in industry, and many of these are actually working for the companies that they did their placement with. Awesome. Hey, Troy, I've got to go and teach now, so thanks a lot for that. I'll, no problem. I'll catch Thank you, later. you so yeah. much for your time, Tony. See ya. Thank you.